is what it's all about. Good morning everybody, welcome back, back in the lakes, today I'm back out with Phil, as you can see, Phil's there, Rick, again as ever, he's miles on, today we are well, currently in White Girl Ravine, we're going to follow this up to Blue Rig, tick that one off, and then we're going to head across, tick the Pave Yark off, done that loads and loads of times but never caught it on video so I'm going to take that one off and then head off over hopefully to Loft Crag somewhere around there pitch a tent I'm in the Herberg Solo tonight forecast 35 mile hour winds so we're in that tonight so we'll be fine anyway we've now got to scramble away at the top of this and this looks absolutely awesome. Views are opening up behind me. Side pack, just over there. That one with a slight dust in the snow. Let's go. Oh, yeah. We. Oh. You can see Rick up there. One lone tree. Definitely worth the visit. You, you, well, that, that's again. Yeah. And then you get Bowfell and Travis, yeah. Palmer's Travis. That's yeah, mint. Yeah. That. Yeah, yeah. How the hell does a tree grow? <laughs> Multiple fire pits everywhere, yeah. just off the edge. I'll tell you what, we've looked out for it's north at last. About three trips. Oh, yeah. Ah, lucky Tony. Bring it on. Right, come on, do the time. In the last few years, we've got snow quite late on, haven't we, really? Mm. It's a bit breezy! 
Woohoo! Our next destination! Another way! Blue Rig! So there you go, this is the summit of Blee Rig. I'll tell you uh, how tall it is in the description. Can't be bothered looking at the minute, it's too very, really very easy. Apparently, it's 1775 feet. Phil's reliably telling me, and if Phil's saying it, it's gotta be right. It's always true. It's gotta be true. Anyway. Blue rig done. Our next stop, just off my shoulder, it's Pave York. That's Pave York. We're going up this side. That's Easy Gully. Straight up there. Onto the summit. Oh, Pave York. Harrison Stickles just over there. We're not doing that one today, we've done that one before. A bit testy today, blowing a gale. Hopefully, it's going to die off later on. Let's forecast clear skies for tonight. I hope we might get a bit of astro. I think the wind dies off overnight, I think we're down to something like 15 miles an hour by the morning. Forecast is currently saying this is about 35. Next up, Pave Yard. Just approaching. Start of easy gully now. This is our final ascent up onto the summit of Pave York. Short climb onto the top. And that's it, job done. We're around number two of the day. Rick sitting on the summit and it will just give it a quick touch I've been up here up teen times before but we'll still top out go what I do well, there you go summit of Pave York we're at number two of the day jobs are good in we've now got ahead well, that away. We'll skirt around the back of Harrison Stickle, and we'll. Uh, hell, and we'll uh, get off towards Loft Crag and find a home for the tents. Oh man, 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 man. Like a stickle. Like a stickle.
straight ahead. I'm on to the mic to mouth, it's absolutely blown a hoolie. Off drag. It's over there. Woohoo! Look at that, I can't stand up. I'll turn around. That makes it mental. Mental out there. That was absolutely mental. You can hear you know, pouring down the rain. That was a forecast. The wind was, but uh, we were meant to have clear skies, no rain. Did snow this morning, that was forecast, but we meant to clear up by dinner time. We now want what? 25 to 6? Pouring down. Anyway. I'm just going to sort out inside of this, get rid of all this mess. And as ever, first job, let's get that kettle on. Oh. I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say it. Well, that was a cracking walk in, wasn't it? Absolutely brilliant. Wine, whatever it's called. I can't remember the name. Another ravine now. White Gill Ravine, was it something like that? Whatever it was, I can't remember. Anyway. I put it also but Anyway, that was pretty awesome. That was awesome. Um quite shot from the wind in the uh, middle of the ravine. ravine. And we got out to the top. Well, before we got to the top, that last, what, 20 feet of a climb, that absolutely got my heart pumping. It was a bit, uh, a bit sketchy to be fair, a bit sketchy. I think the actual path when, when, you, when we walked past was actually straight up, rather than where we came up the east side of the rock. I think the path was actually continued straight up, that continued straight up. Anyway. Oh yeah, absolutely awesome. Two more wing rights ticked off. With, uh, Blue rig, Pave York. Like I said, I've done Pave York up teen times, but never caught it on video. And now we're here just below Love Crag. All three of us pitched up side by side. We're all card locked into our tents at the minute now. This is absolutely hooning down. The forecast is to get better later on though, but it was meant to get better before now to be fair, but anyway. <laughs> Hopefully we'll be able to get out, um, get some astro, get some clear skies. Um, oh yeah. But anyway, I'm going to enjoy this as ever. Hopefully we're going to get out. If not, the next thing you'll see me doing is probably cooking me too. How much are they new? They're about, you can get them for about 220 summer. Oh right, yeah, okay, so quite expensive. Yeah. Well, hey, you can see the moon. Oh, oh. Well, we're out of the tent. Harrison sticker just over my shoulder. Oh, I don't think there's going to be uh, much sitting out tonight. Oh man, I think this is the price that you pay for out on Scarfell in the conditions that we got there because they were awesome, weren't they? I think. 
like one of those and buys you 10 of these. Get some tea on. I'm actually getting hungry now. Today though, we're in something a bit different. The old, uh, look what you found. We're gonna go for some homemade, look at that. Homemade chicken and chorizo pasta. Made that for my tea last night. Made a bit extra and I thought, ooh, what I'll do, I'll stick it in the bag and I will uh, make my own in the bag so we're going to experiment see how that goes and if it works we'll uh, we'll do it again and then we can uh, knock up whatever we fancy jobs are good in and then uh, bring it out next day for uh, for us camping I'm going to stick it in an extra bag I think Just in case. Oh, 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 my delicious chicken and treats or pasta. <laughs> this is a work of genius. Homemade by me. Yes. Yeah. Definite winner. That's gonna rank with my porridge in a bag. Mm. I'm just a camp cooking genius. Oh. So I'm gonna finish this. I think Back outside. The window will drop. <laughs> yeah, maybe. And then we'll uh, get the quarters. Moon's out. Oh. Sauce the wind. I, can't, I cannot remotely stand still. I've got to keep up with the tripod. Otherwise, the yeah, camera blow away. The moon's up there. See? Somewhere? Where is it? There. There it is. Oh. Moon's out. Handful of stars. It's definitely clearing up though. It is clearing up. But yeah. This wind is absolutely mental. That is bitterly cold. The wind chill was talking about minus 10, something like that. You might be right. The camp's all over the place. Right, that's it. It is Baltic. I'm going to do. No chit chat outside tonight, I think. It's too, uh, too cold for that. I think I'm going to uh, get back in the tent and probably want my coffee. The time that's running outside. Not quite sure that's going to get to be honest. Uh, those alert pops up earlier for uh, the Northern Lights. But, uh, that's probably a bit of a long shot to be honest. But you never know, you've got to be in it to win it. Um, wind. Has it dropped? I'm 
quite sure it has to be honest. But it's absolutely freezing outside. Unfortunately, that means there's no uh, chit chat, no dad jokes, and I brought a load as well. I brought a load. So yeah, you're gonna miss out there. Anyway, I'm going to finish this. And I'll see you, hopefully, for a sunrise in the morning. Nice, low winds, clear skies, awesome sunrise. Jobs are good. Let's nice hope. Anyway, that's your night, and I'll see you in the morning. Morning, everybody. I'm about half past five. Golden hour. Just about to kick off outside. Sunrise. In about an hour, uh, half an hour, six o'clock. Absolutely battered last night. Oh man, no wind. Unbelievable. That was the windiest night I've ever had. We survived. Tent seems okay. This morning, for breakfast, put it on porridge. I fancy something a bit different to be honest. So I brought a flapjack. Unfortunately, not a flapjack. Um, a pan of chocolate like you did. But yes, unfortunately, it is now a wafer thin. A pan of chocolate. There you go. Have a look at that bad boy. I'm sure you'll test it. Uh, ah. mm -hmm. yeah, I don't think it went as cold as what it said it was going to do. It was cold last night outside. Three times down there. Weatherland, that's up there. Crinkle Crags, Bowfell, Head Pikes over there. Oh man. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. I don't think we're going to get a sunrise. There's a whole bank of hazy, misty cloud. It's a spot of colour, but I don't think we're going to get anything uh, until it pops above the top. But man, good. <coughs> well, there you go. The sun's just peaked above the clouds. Awesome. <laughs> this is what it's all about. How cool does that look? You don't need to see my face, do you? Smooth out of the way. Depending on whether, <laughs> if you're heading out and it's like 10 mile an hour max, you're yeah. alright. Yeah. If you're heading out and it's forecast possible 50. Well, I've, I've got to say, right, <laughs> when when I was up Ben Man, do it, the forecast 35. And on yeah, top yeah. of that, it was like a hurricane. Yeah, 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 exactly. 
and he went through the similar yesterday. Yeah, 35 mile an hour is a yeah. lot stronger than you think it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, if it is 35 mile yeah. an hour. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, you, yeah. Like, it's like saying the car you say, isn't it? If they're all the same, yeah. awesome is no longer awesome, is it? Awesome exactly. becomes average. Exactly. Exactly. Different experience every time, innit? Yeah. You know. You win. <coughs> Phil. What's, don't do it. Uh, Phil. Don't do it. Phil. Don't do it. I know what's, what's coming. Uh, what's an alien's favourite food? I think I might have heard this one Another before. <laughs> Unidentified frying object. <laughs> <laughs> I went to uh, I went to the zoo. Oh, don't do it. I, I went to the zoo the other day. And uh, there's a slice of toast in a cage. And yeah. Uh, that's the key for us. What's that all about? Look at all that, sir. That's bread in captivity. Anyway, oh. that's it. Couldn't get done last night. So, there you go. That joke's on the summit. They Point worked. two. Brilliant. They weren't funny second time. They were. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it were better second time. <laughs> Cracking view. It's not bad. It's not bad. I mean, you know. Look at that. It's a throne, isn't it? It's a throne. Looking over your kingdom. Hey. All we needed was a nice little uh, cup holder. Yeah. Yeah. All packed up. You know the score. There's nothing there now. Nothing to uh, ever witness that we've ever been. We now just got to head off. That away, dropping straight down back to uh, New Dungeon Gill, back to the van. But what an awesome night that was! Got a bit testy overnight, and the wind actually picked up. But uh, tent did all right, we all survived. No issues, it's good, good, good. All the Langdale Valley spring out in front of us with the mirror just there in the background. Do Dungeon Gill just down there. A little closer, you could probably see the van. White Girl Ravine, where we came up from yesterday morning, just there. Making his way up towards Blue Rig, which is that one over there. But yeah, an awesome start to the day that was, wasn't it? Absolutely epic. Very slog up this way, isn't it? Yeah. Right, well that's it. We're now back at the van. Another top, top weekend. Thanks to Rick, Phil, as ever. Make sure you uh, follow them. Put the link in the description below, as always. But yeah, how cool was that? Absolutely just like that. Give a thumbs up, like, subscribe, all that kind of good stuff. And fingers crossed. See you next time. Bye, 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 bye.